So are you guys new best friends? Yeah. Yeah? Yeah. I'm not shy. Yeah? I'm not shy anymore. <laughs> Good morning. It's Friday. And I know I'm, I'm going to try not to talk about the whole 30 too much, but like, you know, I'm going through it right now. So it's, it's kind of my life right now. I have hit day seven, I think I'm on, and like clockwork, like I didn't even realize this until I checked the book. I am hitting every milestone. I think my whole like emotional ups and downs and grouchiness is t pretty much subsided. My cravings aren't that bad, but I, today, I'll, I had so much energy and then I feel so tired, like I just want to nap. Sure enough, that's what the book says, like day six, day seven, that's what you feel. It's very interesting, this is not for everybody. If I keep saying to Mike, if I didn't have my severe digestive issues to deal with, which this has completely solved, I would not be doing this. So I have good motivation, but this is not easy at all. But I'm gonna stick with it, it's worth it. Um, I also did stick with it at dinner last night at a restaurant, so that's a big deal. Okay, so I've mostly edited my video for today. I had a conference call with my network, which was really good. And I'm gonna head to the grocery store again. I feel like they know me like really well now because I'm there constantly because of this diet. But I'm gonna get some groceries because tomorrow morning we have a whole load of kids coming over and you're, it's gonna be pretty fun. So I'm gonna get prepared for that. And I gotta pick up me and Everly and get the show on the road. I am like a zombie. I hope I have time to have a rest because I'm tired. I'm so tired, but I'm still gonna work out. I haven't, I've worked out the past two days, so. That's something. I'm, I'm, I'm going in the right direction. I can feel it. I can feel I'm going there. I just need to keep moving. We are outside. It is so beautiful out. Oh, someone's dancing. She's dancing. Part of me struggling with seasonal depression is I've been missing being out here. Like honestly, that was such a good summer. And now we have such this beautiful outdoor space. So I, yeah. Nice out here. Mia just closed the door on Everly's fingers. Everly's fingers were in the door jam. Can I see your hand? So this morning, any minute now, Amanda Muse and her kids, Jack and Esme are coming over, and also baby gang, Corey, and her four kids are coming over. So Emily, and then they're triplets. So it's gonna be really busy, but really exciting. I have Mike here as backup. He's gonna be like the dad, the shared husband. We're gonna be sister wives today. <laughs> So they're digging in. Was that good snacks? Corey's here. And we got all, where's all the kitties? There's Emily. Can we say hi? <laughs>
okay, this is funny. We're all with our cameras, like, capture the moment. <laughs> They're multiplying. Are you two having fun? Yes, mister? What's going on up here? Nothing. Nothing? We just playing the game. What, what mess am I about to see? <laughs> what mess am I? <gasps> It's so clean in here. No. Are you guys even playing? It's so clean. <laughs> That's awesome. We don't even know. Fantastic. Or is everything hiding underneath no. the carpet? No. No, you didn't hide it under the carpet. See, I can't even open the carpet. Yeah. Cool. You guys are doing a good job. Yeah. Are you having fun? Yeah. I got the text messages that you were sending on your iPad. <laughs> you sent them to mommy. <laughs> Big goofball. So are you guys new best friends? Yeah. Yeah? Yeah. yeah. I'm not shy. Yeah? I'm not shy. <laughs> okay, Bo, who have you been playing with? Who are you even playing with? Do you remember her name? Do you remember her name? Are you two new best friends? Yes. Are you best friends? Yes. Yes. Wild girl. You're wild. So is this the nice quiet table? Can I hang out at this table? This, yeah. this is like peaceful out here. Are you the future babysitters of all these kids? Okay, so I'm sitting here chatting with Amanda and Corey. Hi. With all of our monkeys, all 10 kids around, but everyone is doing very well, getting along so well. So we are going to do something really fun soon. So we're going to do a Facebook Live with three of us and on each of our Facebooks at the same time. And it's going to be focused on our tips around the holidays, how we can manage with the kids, burnout during the holidays, and even like what I've been going through with the seasonal depression and things like that. So, if you don't already, we'd love for you guys to head over to each of our Facebook pages and like it. I'll add the links below and then we'll let you know when we're going to be doing that. Keep an eye out for it. Um, it should be pretty soon, but I think it's be really fun. And we each come from different places, which is really good. Like Amanda has her two kids and then Corey has four kids and I have four kids and we all have, we're all kind of like coming from different places, but we all struggle with similar things. So keep an eye out for that one. We're, we're gonna go see the girls. We're going to okay, we're, we're like walking at the same time. Yeah, the girls are wearing really nice things. Oh, that's Judy. That's Judy and a funny song. Who's this little guy? High fives. The, the epic play date yes. has come to an end. Look at all the kitties. Thank you for coming, guys. It's so nice. <laughs> it's an adventure. <laughs> okay, so everyone left. I am cooking. I'm making some. Uh, I just threw chicken in there. I don't even know what I'm doing, but I'm threw chicken in the crock pot with some coconut milk and ginger. I'm roasting some vegetables. I made myself a whole 30 salad because I did not break my diet during that play date and I'm gonna make some homemade hamburgers later today. Bo is wiped in such a good way. Like that kid never runs out of energy. She's out of energy. She goes, mommy, can you tuck me into my bed? The whole time it was so cute. They were running, Esme and Bo were running up to each other, throwing their arms around each other, being like, my bestie, my bestie. Like, oh, match made in heaven. I was worried, I knew either those two were gonna be the best of friends or kill each other. Thank goodness they're the best of friends. So they're gonna be together a lot. We plan to have Holden's friend over right now because he was being a, we knew he was gonna feel a little left out. So he's here for the rest of the afternoon. Let's go check on them. What are you two playing in the dark? <laughs> okay, me and Everly had a big nap and now Everly is in a dress with some underwear. Now you pull your dress up if you have to go in the potty. 
We're gonna try Everly with her underwear on and then Mia is totally happy just watching Everly and wearing her diaper. So I think this will go, I think this is a good plan. I'm pretty happy with it. Wait, I think we're gonna do Oh, there's one little one. There we go. There we got it. Um, what, are you, what are you cooking? I'm cooking this. You're cooking this? Okay. Do you wanna go check the honey? Everly just peed yeah. all over one of our beige chairs. We gotta start somewhere, we gotta start somewhere. She peed on this beige chair. Oh no, wait, sorry, I meant this one. That's not a shadow. Is mommy doing a good job? Yeah. Yeah? Is it gross? No. <laughs> Everly says no, he yep. says yes. Everly, is mommy doing a good job? Yeah. You have a look of disgust on your face as well. It's the onions. I'm like. <laughs> so how was your date with Esme? Is she cool kid. Oh, she's snapping. Oh, Mia's snapping. <laughs> Everly, tell me what did you just do? Uh, Fifi. You went. And Mia, Mia went up to Everly and she said, Good job, Everly. Good job. Right? High five. <laughs> you watching Belle? Just watching Beauty and the Beast. Okay, I'm about to head out the door to my brother's 40th birthday. Ah, so I'm going to be out for a couple hours at a bar with them. Mike's here with the kids hiding behind that computer there. <laughs> I'm off. November weather has finally arrived here. Do you see it? Do you see that white stuff on the ground? It's snow! Are you happy? Yeah. What do you guys think? Good. Is this the year you guys will go learn to ski and snowboard? Santa, Santa Claus parade. Yes, we're going to Santa Claus parade today. We gotta move those planters, we gotta cover those chairs. Okay, so church is done and we've gone out for lunch, brunch. We never do this. And with the whole big family, because um, my brothers and my sister-in-law and my parents are here, so we have all the kids here. Is that yummy? <laughs> <laughs> what are you two? What was it yummy? Where is she? Oh! <laughs> Your pigtails. home from brunch and we're quickly going in the house to put snow pants and warm stuff on all the kids and everything and heading to our local Santa Claus parade. I'm like so tired but this is gonna be fun. It'll be worth it. Yeah no naps running from church to brunch to parade. Really what could go wrong. <laughs> Famous last words. And it's and snowing. It's snowing. <laughs> <laughs> all right awesome. let's, let's go do this. <laughs> Just finished. So we just finished the Santa Claus parade. I can't even talk. My mouth is frozen. Barely anyone stayed for Santa. Everyone was leaving. But we <sighs> stayed. We stayed. Mia's doing Holden's hitter. Okay, the weekend is almost done. Mike's bathing in the twins. I'm about to fold the laundry. The house is a bit messy, but. The good thing is I got out, I got social this weekend. I feel, I feel like my seasonal depression and my social anxiety and all that stuff, it's like 
not that bad at all right now. I think also my sugar cravings and withdrawal have passed. So I don't, like I feel pretty good. That shows how much being social is so good for me. I'm going out quite a few times this week as well. So that should be good. That should keep me on track. And right now I'm kind of in one of those moods where I'm thinking about what I have on my plate tomorrow. Anyways, I'm gonna end this video here. If you like this video, hit that like button. And if you haven't subscribed, I'd love for you to subscribe. And if you have subscribed, thank you so much. It means so much to us. I'll see you guys soon. Bye.